fabulous evening to every one of you, fellow Toastmasters, Contest Chair, Contest Toastmasters, and especially you, Vincent. I really love your speech. <coughs> Today, I'm going to evaluate your speech based on the acronym EXIT. E -X -I -T, because that's the first thing that I see when I come in here. Your entrance, the X Factor, your areas of improvement, and what you can take away to do better in the next speeches. First of all, your entrance. I've never met you before, I believe so. Vincent, have you met before? I don't think so, right? So when I saw your name written over here, I was looking around, who is Vincent Chua? And when the contest hostmaster introduced you, suddenly someone came in with a chair and placed it in the middle of the stage. I was like, okay, so that is Vincent. Very good uh, way of introducing yourself, especially when you relate uh, to all the guys here when you finish your national service and got your King identification card. I can also relate and remember the time when I, when, when that happened to me as well. Very good opening, is very relevant and keep it up. Next thing, the X Factor, the things that you did really well in your speech. First of all, vocal variety. I love the way you imitate your mom. You know, I, I couldn't remember what are the words that you say when you meet her, it sounds like a rap. But I love the way when you're sitting here and she was saying, Aboya! It's really very Singaporean and we all can also relate to that as well. I love that. And when you were here doing Tai Chi, you emphasize the word Tai Chi with the gestures and the body language. Secondly also, your X Factor is your body language. The way you use you emphasize different gestures to relate to different words. When you were here also, computer games, you were sitting on a chair playing computer games. When you froze, you literally froze. And I love the way there was one point when you said wow and you put your hand over your mouth. Wow. I love that a lot. Thirdly, areas of improvement, of course. When you say I see, pink I see, I will suggest when you use acronyms, you expand it out, identification card. When you were talking that you had a blurred look on your face, you could be more expressive with that look because uh, it didn't look so blurred to me. <laughs> be more like a sotong. I, I realize you have too many dents at the beginning of every uh, most of the sentence, like then I did this, then I did that. Try to minimize on that pause filler. Lastly, takeaways for your next speech. Very good use of your timing, seven minutes, one second. You use most of the time that is allocated to you and you shared a very relevant topic, a Toastmaster journey that we all can, can, can catch and also know a fellow Toastmaster's uh, journey and also struggles and how he got into it. Especially the relationship between the mother and the son that is very warm and we all can take away. And I, I, I believe that you can use this strength for your other speeches as well. So to summarize, exit, E-X-I-T, your entrance, the X Factor, areas of improvement, and takeaways for your next speech. You are a great speaker, Vincent, and I hope to know you better and hear your other speech. Thank you very much. Contest